Hey everyone, welcome back to Tragic MTG. And as you can see, I actually did it. I hit 10,000 subscribers. Go me. Uh, it's been a long time coming. Um, had a lot of fun on the way here. Um, there was a long time where it seemed like uh, I might not get this far. The subscribers were coming in a little bit slowly. Um, but just kind of plugged away for a long time and it got there. So, uh, really cool. I'm excited. Um, and uh, apparently, so is YouTube. Um, they deemed it fit to send me um, a play button, so I'm going to go ahead and unbox that right now. Uh, it's really cool. I didn't think that uh, you got a play button unless you hit like 100,000 subscribers, but apparently 10,000 will do it. So let's just carefully get into this. Do a play button unboxing. I've seen plenty of other YouTubers do this. It's a pretty exciting moment. Uh, let's see. Well, okay. I guess uh, 10,000 subscribers is the cardboard play button level. That's kind of nice. I um, guess not everything can be silver or gold or whatever. Very nice. Quality construction. Presented to Tragic MTG for passing 10,000 subscribers. Great job. And it's signed from YouTube, so that's pretty cool. Um, the printing seems to be a little off on this, but you know what? It's fine. Hey. I'll take it. That's great. I can put that up on the wall and display it proudly. Uh, looks like they left something down in the bottom of the box there. Oh, that's pretty nice. So then they left me some some magic packs to open. They must they must be viewers. YouTube must watch my channel and uh, know that I'm into uh, old packs of Magic the Gathering. Let me see if I can get this white balance to correct real quick. One second. There it is, auto white balance. We don't want uh, these old packs of legends to look bad on camera, do we? Let's definitely get into these right now. And of course, as always, I will be scanning up the rare. One second. Okay, there we go, ready to scan. Let's open up two booster packs of legends in honor of my milestone here. Hopefully, get something good out of these. Woo! I've opened a couple of these before, and this is probably going to be it. So I believe, hold on real quick, I'm going to look up the order. Okay, so refreshing myself on how to go through these. I'm going to start from the back and just flip them over because that last card right before the rules card is going to be the rare. So here we go. Comment down below, what do you think about all this? Thanks for watching, of course. Like and subscribe. First common, Active Volcano. Destroy target blue permanent. Or do some stuff to an island. We got to remove soul. Very nice, counter target summon spell. Transmutation. Cat Warriors. They have Forest Walk. Glyph of Destruction. Target wall you control gains plus 10 when blocking. Yeah. Come at me, bro. We got Enchantment Alteration. Look at the printing on the, uh, on the text. It's kind of hard to read there. We got Davenant Archer. Giant turtle, it's pretty giant, all right. Equinox, tap land, enchanted with equinox. So some of these commons might be worth a little bit, but I'm going to actually just kind of hold out to scan any obvious big hits. Venerian gold, which I don't think is an obvious big hit. Darkness, now that is an obvious hit. For a common, at least. Creatures attack and block as normal, but none deal any damage. All attacking creatures are still tapped. Play any time before attack damage is assigned. So it's a black fog. Pretty uh, unusual. Let's see here. Get it to scan. Darkness from Legends is 21 bucks. Pretty good for a common. All right. Next up, is this the first uncommon? I believe it might be. Life Chisel. 
four for an artifact. Sacrifice a creature during your upkeep to gain life equal to creature's toughness. Let's go ahead and scan that one up and see how it goes. Five bucks for a Legends Uncommon. Next up, Whirling Dervish. Texture from black gains 1-1. One, one. Use counters at the end of each turn in which it does damage to an opponent. So wait till the end of the turn. 15 bucks for that. Last uncommon. Pavel Maliki. It's a legend. Cost six. It's a five three. You can pay Rakdos to give it plus one until end of turn. Pavel is four bucks. Alright, here we go for the rare. What are we gonna get? Something big, I hope. Eh, it's not too big. Quorum Trench Gnomes. Three and a red. Summon gnomes. Tap to give to target planes. Produces one instead of white until end of game. Use counters. So you can trash on your opponent's planes if you want with this. Let's see how much that goes for. Shockingly, that's a $95 card. All right. Well, I will give it a sleeve. I'm guessing it's a reserve list. Um... I don't know. Does anyone play this card? Any, any old-timey lists that this would be on? There it is, anyway. So, <coughs> we've got one more chance here. Let's get into this. This is my last pack of Legends right here. I bought four of these long ago um, for some special occasions. And here's the special occasion. Let's do it. Oops, going this way here. Got Wall of Heat. There's an Enchanted Being. Any damage dealt to Enchanted Being during combat by creatures with one or more enchantment cards played on them is reduced to zero. That's a tough one to <laughs> pull off, I imagine. Spirit Shackle. Minus two counter. Psychic Purge. Might be an okay common. Check it out later. Rust, counter target artifact effect, which must require an activation cost, but not an artifact spell though. Wall of Earth, it's an 06, whoops. Energy tap, might be a decent common tap. Target untapped creature you control becomes tapped. Add an amount of colorless mana equal to target creatures casting cost to your mana pool. That, it's got some possibilities. I'm gonna scan this one just. To see, oh, it scanned the wrong version. Hold on, the Legends version. It's a buck ninety-seven. It's been printed a bunch of times after that, I think. Alabaster Potion. Target player gains X life or prevent X damage. Oops, don't get two. We got one here. Emerald Dragonfly. Give it first strike. It's end of turn. Blazing Effigy. Let's see, I think this is still in the commons. That's upside down. That's interesting. Cyclopean mummy. Summon a mummy. So these got flipped around at some point. Hopefully not during repackaging this pack. I don't know if it would be or not. We got uncommon wall of wonder. Um it's a wall. Let's see how much it is. It's a little bit, five bucks. Then we've got Rathi Berserker. Very cool. The lowercase r. Is that a common thing? I don't remember that. I haven't seen this card a whole lot. Two and three red. It's a two four to Berserker. You give it it's Rampage 3, which I forget what Rampage does. Rathi Berserker is 490. There's an Urborg. Pretty decent for an uncommon. Add black to your mana pool, or you can remove first strike ability or swamp walk ability from target creature until end of turn. 28 bucks for Urborg. All right, here we go. Last chance at a big rare. What are we going to get from this Legends pack? Zyra Arian. Green, red, and black. Legend. It's a 1 2 flyer. You can then pay that again and tap it. Target player draws one card. Zyra is. 72 bucks. Well, there we go. That was it for my 10,000 subscriber special opening two packs of legends.
There we go. All right. Hey, what do you think down below? Thank you, everyone who's ever watched my channel. And I uh, hope you enjoy it. Um, got more to come. Uh, don't know how far this channel really will go. The algorithm seems to think that this is about the, the peak of my content that I do. And there's uh, not much I can do about that. So anyway, again, thank you. Um, I'll catch you on the next one.